<laughs> this thing sways a lot. Yeah, I'm bouncing up and down. Probably a good thing. I don't think that little girl liked it. She was, doesn't have her sea legs yet. There's a little uh, glass bottom up ahead, but let's take a look here. This is a new sky bridge. We came last year and it was like a couple days away from opening, so we missed it. Came back today. Kind of expensive, really, for what it is. I think they're trying to compete with Anakista, who has a lot more to offer, in my opinion. This tourist ahead of me just cut in front of my... <laughs> Here's the glass bottom, which they had to just fix because some dumb dumb jumped on it the last week and they had to close this thing. It cracked. That could be a bit unnerving if you're afraid of heights. It's a pretty good view of Gatlinburg from up here. Um, not quite as wide as I thought because I guess the chairlift over there blocks things. But Gatlinburg is actually pretty tiny when you really see it from up above. But it's packed full of stuff. So I heard if the bridge breaks and you get stuck on the other side, you have to zip line uh, on this line up here. No, I'm kidding. That would be cool though. Definitely no shortage of zip lines here. I've done some. Set up a lot like a tightrope would be for a tightrope walker. And if you can see the, yeah, the cables tied down right there. Stability. Gatlinburg is uh, really amazing. They had, of course, those fires in 2016. We were here shortly after, and fortunately, the town didn't burn up mostly. It's been uh, making a nice comeback. Of course, at this point, June 19th, 2020, we're still dealing with the COVID thing. And here we are, across. Yeah, so on this side over here, you're gonna have a little refreshment stand. You've got uh, on that side right there is Ober Gatlinburg with their tram. That's the entrance to the Smokies right there. You'll see no development up in those mountains, part of the park.
I don't know if anybody even goes to that uh, tower there anymore, really. It's kind of old. <laughs> can see it swaying really really good there's a lot of people crossing especially in the middle let's give you an idea <laughs> you know it's it's kind of wide and um, so it doesn't feel so scary here's the uh, gift shop and snack stand down on the lower level and you can go up here as well and um, bring your food up there and eat oh, there's another little snack bar up there A little snack bar area in there you can come on out here if you like cool thing is everything's brand new here so it's all nice and shiny and fresh you can have your snack out here while you overlook Gatlinburg So overall, I would say the um, experience is cool. It's it's nice. I mean, for 25 bucks, you do get to go on the um, sky bridge all you want. You can come back again later all day up until 10 o'clock and see it at night. We might. We'll see. Um, yeah, they're having to compete a lot here with other places like Anakista. It's got a lot of this. I bet you there'll be a mountain coaster coming here really soon. They're doing some construction around here, so we'll see. But cool experience. We enjoyed it. Did you enjoy it? I did. Oh good. Okay. <laughs>